Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are talking about Tim Means vs. Court McGee. Now, Tim Means, 33 wins, 16 losses, 1 draw. He's 1-4 in, in his last 5 fights. Minus 230 favorite, 40 years old, 6-2 with a 75-inch reach, coming off of the second knockout of his career. Big, nasty uppercut by Euros Medic. Court McGee, 21 wins, 13 losses. He's 2-3 in his last 5 fights on a 3-fight losing streak. Plus 190 underdog at 39 years old. 5'11 with a 75 and a half inch reach. Half inch reach advantage with a 3 inch height advantage for Tim the Dirty Bird means. Now, I, I, I actually really, really like this matchup. I think it's a, it's a very good matchup for veterans that are kind of on their way out, to be honest. 25 total finishes for Tim Means. He has 16 first round finishes. He's been finished 10 times. Out of those 16 losses, he's been finished 10 times. He's been TKO'd three times, which was Euros Medic and then Nico Price. The other one was well down here. Probably back in 2004 or something, but. I'm pretty sure it was only a yeah, guillotine by Matt, rear naked choke by Oliveira, very two close split decisions against Bilal and Sergio Marais, and then Nico Price finished him. But again, I, I, I really like Tim Means. I think if you're a fight fan, you, you have to really like him. He's just one of those guys. The thing that hurt, is hurting Tim Means a lot right now is his age. The wear and tear on his body, his chin is not the same as it used to be. His speed, his combinations are not how they used to be. We've seen it a little bit still there with Andre Filio, but even with that, the, the problem with that is, you know, Andre Filio is is gonna be there. So Tim, it's not like he has you know have to use footwork or anything like that. He's just constantly right there in front of him. So he's been finished. Seven times in the UFC, he has eight finishes himself. himself. Again, this is a guy that I, I really, really like. It sucks to see a, a fighter get older because this is what can happen. You know, you go from a guy that's, you know, one of those nasty strikers, and then he kind of becomes more of a grappler, still strikes sometimes, but he's not looking to strike all the time because he can't take the same punishment as he used to. He can't recover the same. And Court McGee at 39 years old, be 40 soon. He has 10 finishes. He has four first round finishes, but he's also been finished three times. This is a guy for a long time that never was finished. I mean, that's that's the reality on him. You know, he was a guy that Santiago Ponzinibbio was the first one to TKO, and then Jeremiah Wells, and then uh, Matt Brown finished him with a big right hook. And he, I thought he was having moments against. Uh, uh, who was it? I thought. Oh, Alex Morono. I thought he was having moments against him. Um, he just he couldn't keep up with Morono, which is kind of not good. But again, I really like Tim Means. I think this fight is going to be exciting if you like these two fighters. I'll be rooting for Tim Means. Court McGee's pressure and grappling ability might make this a little bit more of a, a, a tougher matchup for Tim Means. Um, uh, activate. Uh, but yeah, um, I, I really like Tim Means in this one. I think his combinations, I think his ability to mix in the striking with his grappling, I think can do some really, really good stuff. But as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment, and let me know you're picking. Put your comments down below on what prediction video you want to see next. I'll, I'll do it sometime tonight after work. Thank you guys so much. Peace.